Okay, we're looking at a rotary steam tube dryer. It's built by Louisville Dryer. Uh, this dryer weighs about 100 tons. Uh, it's gonna travel on these rolling rings, which are 4140 forgings, uh, specifically um, heat treated to, uh, to a hardness of about two, 280 to 300 Brunel hardness, setting on these pads. And we, we spend a lot of engineering um, time developing the um, runouts on these tires so that they they match perfectly. What happens, the longevity of the dryer is fixed on how much this shell flexes when it rotates, so it's critical that that fit. Uh, you looked at the other end of it where we feed into it, it would discharge, the material would discharge through these ports. These are the same tubes that extend through that end. This area right here is an ASME code vessel where we're gonna put the steam. It's kinda like a boiler. You, we've taken a couple of the handhold covers here the tubes tie into a sheet right here. The stream steam is dispersed into the tubes, and as it as it condenses, the condensate comes back down, is channeled over into that sump, and is taken back to the boiler to be resupplied back into steam.